Okay guys, I'm back up when I do this video on interior lighting. I was having an issue with um, the interior lights not coming on when I'd opened my door at night. And I was like, you know, having, uh, you know, some friends, I was dropping them off from the airport the other night and the interior lighting there wasn't coming on. So it was hard to see bags and things like that. So how you make that happen is um, if your light's not coming on, you simply touch this button here. There you go, the lights will come on. Now, if you want it to automatically come on and then go off when you lock the car, or if you're sitting in here, it'll go off in like 30 So you have to hold it. So let's hold it until it flashes. There you go. And so now what'll happen is you'll be able to exit your vehicle and enter your vehicle and it'll come on. So now it's not coming on, it's the actual opposite way. So let's do it this way. Let's let it flash. Okay, so now it's on. You can see it's on down there. It's on back there. You know, the ones down there as well. And so what'll happen is this will go off if I, if I sit in here for like 45 seconds, but I'm not gonna do that. I'll go ahead and open the door and then close it and lock it. So the, door, so the lights are still on. We're gonna exit the vehicle. You can see the lights are still on there. You can see these nice little ambient lights, by the way. You can set that on your screen. Those are pretty cool at night. Well, right, let's close it up. And you'll see that light is still on until I put my finger on the door to lock it should go off in just a moment there it went okay so if you're having that same situation which I was having because this is a new car to me that's how you fix that issue all right guys take care